Okay, guys and gals, we're down here at the shop. As you can see outside, it's raining dogs and cats out there. We was on the big pond yesterday, trying to make a little bit of video, try to catch a bass. And that rain came in and I had to get out of there. And uh, I was going again this afternoon. And you can see what happened. So that gave me a little bit of time to uh, work on my unit here. A little old John boot. This little old 10 foot John boot that I got. Uh, what I've been doing with it, let me get around here and show you. I was watching Bill Dance the other day and on his program they had one of these John Boat stabilizers and a light went off in my brain and that happens every now and then. <laughs> but anyway, I decided to build me one. So let me get, her, get you around here where you can see what I was doing. I made me a, an L bracket here. Then I welded me a piece of uh, one inch conduit to it. <clears throat> and I tried to figure out what I could do to make me a pole. So this is what I come up with. <laughs> I know you'll enjoy this. But, uh, these are mock broom handles. And uh, it's made out of, I don't know if that's conduit, it's steel, I, th I guess, but uh, it's real light stuff, and it's pretty steady. So, I have got me three or four of those, and wiped in to throw them things out. I say just about everything. But uh, as you can see, I start right here, I made this. I made this pole, and it's uh, my boat's 10 foot, and I made the pole 10 foot long. I had it with me yesterday, and, and make sure it worked, and it did. So I got down here a little bit earlier today and painted it. So I got me a state now. This this one, the short one. But you can see, uh, I'm gonna fix it. Fix the end up where it'll be a little bit sharper where it'll go in the ground. But what I'm gonna do with that, if if I uh, use my boat to get into them beaver lodges, then I can use that one, hopefully, to uh, stabilize my boat there. Won't be running off on me. <laughs> but uh, that's what I've been doing. I looked those things up on on uh, my phone and just about every one that I found was anywhere from 150 on up for those uh, little old kits. And I said, shoot, I can make me one of them. It took me about an hour to put it all together. But you can bring those things over. I got my little wire, wheel, wire welder here and uh, what I did, I put it on the lowest one because that stuff's pretty thin. And uh, they make two different sizes. As you can see, this this size is a little bit bigger than this one, and, and this one will slide right into that side, uh, just perfect. So I drilled a, a little hole in this and then slid it in there and spot welded. Uh, you can't hardly see it on this one, but uh, when I slid it up in there, I spot welded it. Uh, with that welder over there and uh, it worked pretty good so that's what I've been doing today saving a little bit of money <laughs> some of that redneck stuff but uh, doing the best best I can with what I got alright y'all enjoy your day have a good time be careful out there this old woody we kicking out again <laughs>